Okay, right, guys, welcome back because I can gaming. And if you watched the last video, you did see I got this Mercedes Benz for free. Just look at it. This car, oh, look at the dash. This car is gorgeous and it was free, so I'm definitely not going to complain. Look at the lines of it. So, if you are a 90s baby and you love these cars, well, I know I do. This is why I'm here. But today, we are going to do something that we haven't done before on the channel. I want to go through and do all my wheel spins. So I've been saving quite a few of them and I want to see what I'll actually get. So let's see how many regular wheel spins we have. Whew, 225 regular wheel spins. I don't even know. I'm just going to back out for a second. So I have $325,000. I wonder how much I'm going to get. Let's start off. Should we do super wheel spins first? The super's nice. I think I might do regular because it's going to get rid of all the, the clothing and stuff. So I started off with about $300,000 and I'm just going to let this play through and see what I can get for wheel spins. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, it does help me a lot if you hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. And if you want to play with us and we have, hopefully Ben's going to be joining us. If you're an OG to the channel, you know Ben, Mitch and everybody else. We're going to be jumping on and we're going to be going to do more live stuff guys so add us and make sure you uh join the car club because i can gaming so as you see here so far nothing too crazy i'd like to see some nice cars is what i'd like to see so anyone that hasn't added me to this account this is actually lucifer so that's my gamer tag you should see it coming up in here and there on the screens if you guys want to add me now the bad thing is why I started with the regular wheel spins is because I know I'm going to get a lot of emojis, a lot of clothing, so I'm kind of just want to get that out of the way so I can get some good stuff on the super wheel spin. That is my theory, so hopefully this pans out. And as you see right now, it's just horn, clothing, Camaro, is that all one? Nice. I do like that car. In real life, I don't know how it's going to be in game, $175,000, ooh. I want that. I want the Lambo Fours Edition. And $25,000 is going to have to do. Oh, look at that. TVR. Beautiful, beautiful UK car. Come through. Glasses. This is the bad thing. Is It'd be nice once all the clothing has gone. $40,000. So I'm just going to let this play through, guys. You guys can listen to some music. Make sure you tell me what your favorite thing is that I won. Maybe I'll get that, uh, ooh, I like that Mercedes-Benz GTR there too. Maybe I'll get a nice Forza Edition car, or tell me what you guys got. What is the best thing you guys got in a wheel spin?
Now, I remember back in, I think, 4, that the Bentley had a lot of uh, car perks for, like, money. So I'm going to have to check that one out. So, so far, not too bad. Uh, we're almost halfway through, guys. Nothing too crazy, but we are getting up there. It looks like I'm, I am ranking up quite a bit of money, which is nice because, you know, I only had, like, 300000 when I started this. So it's not terrible, but uh, let's see what else we get. Oh, my first Forzathon car through the wheel spin. So... Not terrible, but uh, let's see if we can get some more. And there we have it, guys, our second Forza Edition car. This time it's the AMG CLK GTR. I just came in with this car because I got it on my other wheel spin. So that's kind of nice that I have both now. 150 spins left. Let's hopefully we can get some more Forza Edition cars. Oh, just missed the Mercedes-Benz truck. I do want that. <laughs> the Superman, look at that. Ooh, now if you remember for the Horizon 4 guys, the SVT Cobra R was a car to have for A, well it's a Mustang, it looks good, but B, it had some good tunes, and it was a quick car. And it was actually a rare car when it came out in Horizon 4. I'd like to get that GTR. Ooh, there we go. We got the 917 Porsche. Another very expensive car. Nice to see that. Add it to my garage. And then I get a Miata. Womp, womp, womp. BR6 Corato. I wish that was in my garage. <laughs> M5 BMW, I would have preferred the Hellcat. As you can see, I am getting my fair share of horns and clothing, so I'm hoping that I can get this stuff out of the way. And then my future videos, I won't have to worry about. Nice AMG hammer. That was a coupe too. That was actually quite nice. Down to 110, guys. I know I got some cash. I know I'm going to have like 4 or 5 mil easily, which will be quite nice. $250,000. That's, that's not bad, not bad. Ooh. 
leave your predictions down below, guys. How much cash do you think I'm going to get out of all this? Will it be 10 mil? 5 mil? It's hard to say. It's going to be between, I think, 75, 7.5 mil is what I'm going to think. Another Bel Air, this time the Hoonigan edition. That was a hard card to get in four, so it's nice to see it back in five. Give me the Fair Lady. Nope. Woo! I got a skirt and I'm a male, so that doesn't do nothing for me. Womp, womp, womp. Another 50,000 to add to the bank. BRZ, that is definitely hitting the auction. That's another good thing to point out, guys, is if you see some cars that I won here, most of them I'm just going to toss on the auction back for a minimum bid because I don't want them in my garage. So if you guys are looking to get a cheap car that maybe you guys might like, make sure you check out my auctions. Could I auction off those pants? That'd be quite nice. $45,000, it seems like a drop in the bucket. Ooh, we just missed the freaking Lambo. I want it. The Volkswagen Beetle is nice, though. Especially, uh... Oh, we missed the Morris again. $175,000. I'll take that as well. $125,000. Ooh, yeah, that's what, my third Forza Horizon car. So we do got the Fair Lady Z. It's obviously the off-road edition, but I do like that. That's nice. Oh, I'll make that four Forza Horizon cars. Back to back. The Pagani. Thank you. I do enjoy that as well. Come on now. I'd like to see that Lambo. Oh, I just missed it. Could you imagine getting three back to back? That would have been crazy. Another one. Look how close I'm getting. Oh, I just missed a drift truck. That would have been nice. I do want that. R6 Audi. Eh, I think that will definitely go to the auction house. The RX8 will go to the auction house. I'm going to be tuning these cars for days. There we go, guys. I am a Dodge fan, so the Challenger RT is definitely going to be a keeper in my garage. Oh, and the Super Sport Chevelle. You know, you can't go wrong with some old muscle cars. $200,000 to help modify them. That's not a bad thing. Might need that money. $35,000. Thinking my prediction of 7.5 million might be a little off because it's not like it's hitting a lot of high dollar. And it's going to take a lot to get there. Oh, <laughs> if you guys are familiar with Horizon 4, you know that this is probably what is the fastest car in the game until the Evo uh, 599 uh, came out. So, or the Ferrari Evo 599 came out. So, that is nice to see. Let's get some tunes on that. Hopefully, we can put some fast times on that and uh, some uh, straight stretches. John Cooper Works Mini. Definitely hitting the auction with that. Won't lie. I kind of would like the Maserati. Just because I like to get all the 4th edition cars in there. It would be nice to have them all. Renote will definitely go to auction. $100,000. Thank you very much. Looking like I'm getting some decent cars. Now that golf bar used to be a rare car in 4. Ooh, $300,000 to modify, and we just missed out on the GT40. Which used to be the car to buy to flip when we were giving money away. Oh, I just missed it again. $125,000. I'll take that. 
hopefully my super wheel spins will be a, a little better. Mind you, I think we did pretty good. 200k. $25,000. I guess I won't say no to that, but give me... Oh, there we go. I was about to say, give me the Forza Edition. That's what? Four? Five? I lost count. I think it's four Horizon Edition cards I got. That's pretty cool. I'd like to have one of those in my garage too. $20,000. Got a little quick on that one. The Regera Konasag. Yeah, you know, I'm not going to say no to that. $200,000. I'll take that as well. And then we finish it up with a nice rare horn. Said nobody ever. Womp womp. <laughs> oh god. Wow. I guess when you make fun of the horns, you get three back to back. So now that we're out of the horn streak, I guess I spoke too soon on that one. Now I'm getting the the horns, the socks, the clothing, the skirts, the things I do not need or want, but Lisa's getting it out now. There we go. AE86 Toyota. I think that will be a future drift build. Give me the Focus. Kind of want the Focus RS, not going to lie. $175,000 isn't too bad. Top it off to forty five would be $220,000. You know, there's another thirty. dollars there's 250000 on three spins. It's really not that bad. There we go. A Lambo, but I missed the Forza Edition Pontiac yet again. I kind of want that car. Just because, you know, who doesn't like a third gen? $300,000. I don't want the Land Rover, I'm not going to lie. But I want the socks a little less than the Land Rover. And we have ourselves the... Is that the electric Porsche? $250,000. Thank you. Take that all day long. <laughs> Finish it up with 175. We are down to 16 wheel spins and it's just raking in the money and an Escort RS Turbo. You know, it's not a bad car. Austin Healy. Next on the line. There we go. I'm a Dodge fan, so I definitely want a Viper in my garage. Come on, give me that Forza Edition. $175,000. Hundred K and another horn. I want the Lambo. Down to our last ten spins, guys, for the regular spins, and then we'll jump over to the super wheel spins and see if we can get Oh <laughs> There we go. Said I wanted it, I got it. That's at least a five fours edition cars. Just, it's just a thing of beauty. There we go. Let's see here. SBT a Raptor 2011. That would have been the 6562. 6-2 in it. Oh, it's gonna inactivity. It's gonna kick me. Got to back up for a second. There we go. Let's go back into that. <laughs> it's kind of weird that it was gonna kick me when I'm in there playing. Okay, back to wheel spins. We have four left. $25,000. Three. I did get the Lambo, so I'm quite excited about that. Out of all my wheel spins, I think that was probably the one I wanted the most. Ooh, a Ferrari 365. Last wheel spin, guys, before we jump over to the super wheel spins and see what we got. Piece of clothing. All right, so we started off with like $300,000 and change, closer to $400,000. We'll collect that. I have $10 million. Wow. A lot more than I thought. So, to the super wheel spins, we only have 12. I'm gonna let it go on its own just to see if that helps. So we did get the third gen I wanted, but not the Forza edition. Fairly 94, 1994 Nissan 3, not three, it's a 300 ZX. All right, you know, I guess I can't complain about spending that money on that house the other day. Guys, leave a comment down below. Tell me what the best car I got today was that you think. What would you want if it was you?
Oh, I stopped that one early, but I did get myself the off-road Porsche 911. So I kind of can't complain on that one. I gotta stop it early because it just it goes so slow. Audi Quattro, $45,000 and a horn. Yeah, hopefully the Quattro is a nice looking car. Keep going, guys. Six more spins. Aerial Atom, $20,000 and a horn. Down to five. I gotta do it. Hit it. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I just missed the Fair Lady again, but I got a 69 Nova. You know, Nova would be a nice car. Put a nice 454. I wonder if you can LS swap the Nova. We should build an LS swap the world. Hootigan Escort. And then we have ourselves another Forza Edition. I think I already got the Morris Minor once, so that might be my second. So they're definitely going to hit the auction block if that's the case. So $185,000 on that. We will spin. I think I racked up. I think my luck is done. There's nothing more. Oh, I know I didn't get the Maserati yet. So that's going to be another. That's what? Six? We should have had a counter going. How many of the Forza Edition cars did we get? Scroll through. I'm going to let this one go on its own. Come on now. Come on now. BMW i8 and $300,000. That's not bad. Last spin, guys. I think I did pretty well. That I started off with uh, almost $400,000. Ah, there we go. We got the Ferrari P4. And I'm only saying that because it's probably worth a lot of money. That's not bad. RX-7, Ferrari, and a Ford Transit. So, let's see. What would you like to do to this car? I already own it. Sell it for twelve five. Send as a gift. Now, if you guys add me and I can send it as a gift to people, I would send it as a gift now because... Now you want to find this. You know... You pick the sort of drivers you want and I'll get to it. Um, new players, returning players, new Hall of Fame members, community. Let's do Want that. To leave a message. Might be nice. Nobody ever leaves us a note. You're an Here's awesome player. One. Do you want to put your name on this or leave it anonymous? This is what someone will see when they find your gift. Happy with that? There we go, guys. You see my name right there, Zeusifer. Make sure you add me up because I will be giving away other cars. Uh, this car will not be added to your garage. Are you sure you wish to continue? Yes. Don't show this message again. So, if you're new to the channel, guys, subscribe. Turn on post notifications. you just seen that we smashed out and a whole goes. bunch Trust of wheel me, spins, guys. Goes a long way around here. Thanks. $12 million is what we finish with, guys. And then we get to cars. We can check out my cars real quickly. And we can see what we actually got here. So, I'm going to start auctioning off some of these cars. Because, let's face it, I don't need this many cars. So maybe I'll even just start giving them away. I'll wait till I get some friend requests in and I can start giving away cars that I'm not gonna use. I'm gonna set some up for tuning so that way if you guys have some stuff to do. So we do have a Forza Edition uh, RT Challenger. I didn't know that was even a thing. So anyways, guys, I do appreciate it. We'll do a video of the garage a different day when I keep cars. So thanks a lot and I'll catch you on the next one.